Police and community relations are something that we all want. This mural is a lot about change and acknowledging. It's, it's not tone deaf to police relations and the tensions that's being felt around the country. With the help of Bloomberg and with this grant, we plan to paint murals around three intersections. So in the spring, we'll be painting two more in each of the three patrol divisions in Norfolk. The street here is the focal point of the area. And so the open space that you see here will be a community park. So the initiative we're pushing in the city of Norfolk is to work with police and community relations coming together to paint and enliven the neighborhood. The challenge would always be the trust with the community and the police. We're trying to build better relationships for our officers and for our citizens. It's the best way to do that is get involved. And so painting is just a, another way to do it. It's another way to engage. If it's through art, then that's what we do in order to bridge the gap. So on the design, there's the sack of cola nuts uh, symbol. Uh, it looks like a flower, and you know it represents abundance and affluence. So I just wanted to you know, in, embellish the, the neighborhood with that energy. I would say that doing public art projects is a powerful way just to inspire the youth and even the, the older generations, and to make them just feel more proud about their neighborhood. Art makes a place really unique and a place where strangers can come together and meet. The arts have the power for healing and for change.